Uh, just sort of a quick bust out to show how full of shit Lazar is. Um, he's the expert on Area 51. I mean, he went in and drove around with flying saucers and tested them. Okay, now here's Area 51. His secret place with the flying saucers is 15 miles to the south. Okay, so we'll take Area 51 and we'll call this the starting point. Uh, you have the runways and everything, and uh, the roads going in and out for the equipment and stuff are clearly visible. There's the runways, one of the most top secret uh, areas in the world. Okay. Um, the Russians, everyone fly over it. I think they say two times a day they take pictures of it to see what we're up to and to spot shapes of new jets being developed. This, that, the other thing. Okay, now there's Area 51. And uh, let's let's go 15 miles to the south, uh, where he said his secret place was, uh, and there it is. Okay, it could it could be left or right. He, you know, he didn't say southwest, southeast, but he said 15 miles to the south. The reason he said that is because he wanted to make it seem like it was a secret place only he knew of. Uh, because too many people could point out he never was at Area 51, this area. So for his story, he chose 15 miles to the south. There's nothing there. There's nothing there, people. Also, when he made a lot of his statements, Google Earth was just kind of coming into play where you can zoom right up on something as big as a bread box. There's nothing there. Okay. Let's say he meant a little bit south or east or whatever. Let's, let's look around. Maybe it was 12 miles, okay? Maybe it was 16 miles. There's nothing there. There's nothing there. Now, how did he cover that part of the story? Uh, he said at one point, well, they, the doors were at an angle. That way it blends in with the mountains. <laughs> That's why he said that, is because nothing is there. And he knew if anyone went there or got satellite photos, they would see nothing was there. So he threw in, well, it's angled doors that blend right into the, the mountain that you don't see. There's nothing here that shows any kind of construction except old, old roads and old washes. Okay. Uh, even on, uh, as we inspect North Korea, we can spot anything. If a tunnel is being dug, a bunker is being dug, we spot it instantly. Okay, see here? It's not there. There's nothing there. He's a con man. Con man. Uh, to come in and build a bunker with flying saucers, uh, there would be evidence of uh, construction, roads, stuff like that. For instance, even over here in places like this on the desert, you can still see uh, wagon train marks where a wagon might pull off to the side to camp and the, the marks are clearly visible. I'm not saying they're visible here, but the point is there absolutely is nothing there in this area that he, he speaks of. He's a bullshitter and con man.